What's up, everybody? Okay, so um, today's video is going to be a Roses haul. Um, I just got back from Roses. It is 6.41 p.m. It feels like 10 o'clock, but yeah. Anyway, I just got back from Roses. Um, this is going to be a small, but I guess expensive, semi-expensive haul. Um, a lot of stuff... Message from Skylar. was... A lot of the stuff that I got today was like impulse buys. I literally only went to Roses for, for like maybe a bag worth of stuff and came out with like three or four boxes. Yeah. <laughs> Which I kind of figured I was because like when I got everything on my list, I was like, that's it. I'm done. Like, I feel like I was going to store empty handed. So I'm like, I need something to like feel like I shopped. You know what I mean? So it's probably a shopper's problem. But anyway, let me know in the comments if you guys have that same like feeling or whatever when you go into the store. Especially when you got a little bit of change, you know, a little couple, couple of quarters in your pocket. You know, let me know in the comments. Anyway, so I'm going to get started. Um, over here in Pause Buy, number one, this was a Fisher Bluetooth portable speaker, I want to say. Um, I'm hoping the box doesn't make it look actually bigger than it is because 8 inches is not really that big. However, comma, I, I keep thinking this is like one of those like tailgate speakers, but they had tailgate speakers and it was like 50, 60 bucks. This is like, I think $39.99. So I'm, I'm hoping, you know, it's kind of decent. Like it's big and it has a big sound. You know what I mean? It says it has powerful bass, uh, Bluetooth, USB, micro SD, FM, aux, mic, all that stuff. So it kind of feels like a tailgate speaker. Um, it has a little handle on it. I guess a little... I call it a uh, suitcase handle. I guess it's called a telescopic. But yeah, so I'm going to hopefully, I'm going to unbox this later on. Probably not in a video because I want to try all this stuff out um, and see, you know, how it is first. So I might do a video. I'm not exactly sure. But anyway, this is $39.99. So they had some other ones, but as soon as how I already had trouble carrying this home with the rest of my stuff, I had to get an Uber, I mean a Lyft home because... I don't know when I first came out of the store. <laughs> okay, y'all. So quick, message like, from Eric. So quick story, y'all. Um, I came out of Roses and I couldn't figure out how to carry my stuff, get it to the bus stop without dropping it or whatever, or like seeing you know where I'm going. And then when I got out, when I got home, literally got out the home. I mean, the, when I got home out the lift, I literally picked up the stuff. And, and I guess the first time I had this one standing upwards, so like I couldn't really stack everything. My brain wasn't working. Why, when I got home, I literally put it's like three other boxes on top of this one and carried everything home comfortably and safely. I was like, really? I could have did this when I was out there at Lyft. I mean, when I was out there at Lyft, <laughs> when I was out there at Roses, it was funny. Y I just, I was just like, really, really. Now I figure out how to carry it. Really, after I was spending like twenty dollars on the Uber, really. But whatever. So yeah, um, just a little funny thing that I'll pay attention next time. Um, over here I got uh, the multi pack of the plastic cutlery. These are a dollar each. I actually needed these because I was running low. Um, back here is another impulse buy. Impulse buy number two is this RCA home pro home theater projector with Bluetooth. And I'm at says and with Bluetooth. What the, what kind of what kind of that's weird. I don't know. Maybe the speaker in this. I mean, yeah. Hmm. The possibility is endless. I've never had a, a projector before. And I have two TVs. So I'm not sure exactly how I, I mean, why I bought this. Yeah. Um, we'll figure it out. You know, I always do. Um, because my TV is sitting up in front of my wall. So it's like, how am I going to project? You know what I mean? So, like I said, I'll figure it out. Um, but if push comes to shove, I'll just do it like facing the... Uh, the uh, patio door, just close my, my little blinds and hey, whatever. I might just do that. That's actually a good idea now that I think about it. Um, over here, I got another. Uh, this is a Type C USB cable for a phone. I hope it's fast charging. If not, that'd be cool. But this is really the only one I could find that was like decent quality. Roses had a lot of empty boxes where people you can tell had went in them, you know what I mean, took something out, whatever. And my friend is right, that is a pretty ghetto store. But I like it. Don't get me wrong. You know what I mean? It's a nice store. Don't let that discourage you. But, you know, you just live in an area where you see a lot of obvious theft. You know what I mean? It just it just drives me crazy. I used to see the same thing at Dollar Tree. And it's like, really? Little small shit. Like, y'all can pay for this shit. Come on now. Stop being petty. Like, petty theft. Literally petty theft. It irritates my fucking soul. I work in retail, so I get it. Um, oh, yeah. So, over here, this is a gaming keyboard with multicolored backlight. 
Um, and at first, I was like, wait a minute, I have two of them at home. Then I realized what I can use this for. My PS3 is now in my bedroom TV, and it doesn't have a keyboard. So, this will be my little typing keyboard for when I'm in the bedroom with my PS3. So, yeah, I got one for my, I got one for my PS3, my PS4, and now for my um, uh, TV, I think. My smart TV. I don't know. I'll figure it all out. Now I got one set for each one. I got to move shit around and, like, lose shit. Um, and then over here... This is Drano Max Gel. I just used some of this stuff, as a matter of fact, on my bathtub earlier, and I should probably check that. I ain't, oh shit, I didn't run the water. I've been gone for like the last three hours, two hours, no, almost four hours. I left here at like 2.30, and I know, 2.30? Anyway, I should probably go run some water in that drain. Hopefully I have a drain left. But yeah, this stuff works. This stuff really works. Um... This is one of those things that I would recommend if you have a, a clogged, like if water is going out slow, which I hate. That drives me crazy. I would not get in a bathtub if the water is not going out. I don't know what it is, but I hate getting in a tub with standing water when the shower is on. It, it just I don't want my feet wet, like standing in a puddle when I'm showering. That just, it drives me crazy. I don't know, which is, it's, I feel like I'm standing in a half bathtub, if that makes sense. I don't know. But yeah, this stuff is really great. Um, By the way, the... Uh, like I said, the silver was a dollar. The projector was fifty nine ninety nine, and I looked at this so many times and said, "Nope, I don't need it. Nope, I don't need it." When they first came out with it a couple of weeks ago, I said, "Nope, I don't need it." Got it anyway because I had the money. Um, over here, like I said, this was three ninety nine. Um, the keyboard I want to say was ten ninety nine, so not a bad price. I wish it would have had the set. I would have got the set. I would have preferred the set, but they didn't have the sets left. So yeah, I just got it individually. Um, then I got this uh, automatic glade refill. This is the warm flannel embrace, fern, sandalwood, and cardamom. Cardamom. It's limited edition, so I'm assuming it's like wintery type thing. Um, so now I got, whenever the other one's running out, I'll have one for that one. Whichever one runs out first. Um, back here, I got me a uh, waste paper basket for my bathroom. The one I have now is currently similar to this. But I think I bought it from the Dollar Tree, so it was kind of flimsy and bendy. And every time I pick it up, it's always bending. This one's a little bit more sturdier. It doesn't bend. You know what I mean? That's kind of what I wanted. So this one's pretty good quality or whatever. It was, uh, I think, $3.99. Was it $3.99? I don't know. Uh, really? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's $4.99. Okay, so still not a bad price. The one I got from Dollar Tree was a dollar, so... The quality is the price was worth it. The price and difference was worth it. Um, also got me one of these feather dusters. I don't 